Hey everybody, hello. What's going on? How are you doing today? How was your day? Mine was, you know, a day and now I'm home from work and then tomorrow is Thursday and then we're off Friday. So yay! Okay, that's about it. I don't have any news. I went to work. I did my work. I hit my deadlines. Yay! Then I came home, I went to the pharmacy for lunch, which is my favorite place to go to lunch. Picked up a bunch of prescriptions, yippee ki -yay. And did I do anything else? Came home, walked the dog. That's about it. But anyway, I have, this is gonna surprise you, but I've got a Timu haul and it came in an orange bag. Let's pose like this, just in case there's nothing else in here to pose with. Cheese, here, put it, cheese. Oh, I'm not gonna say cheese through this whole thing. Okay, that's my attempt. What is happening up here? What is this? Stop that. These little pieces of hair, oh, quit it. Just don't look at those, please. Percy, I don't know where, oh, there he is, judging. Okay, let's see what's in this Timu bag. I can't tell if people watch this channel because they like it or because they're morbidly fascinated by the extent to which I have a Timu bag every day almost. I, I don't know. For me, it might be the latter if I were to watch a channel like this. I don't know, you guys. But yeah, I buy a lot of stuff from Timu. Okay, here's a box, and let's see what's in the box. Am I recording? Yes. Okay, two minutes and two seconds in. We're hauling the first thing. This is a gift for a friend. And she is, uh, I forget her name in Greek mythology. But she's got... She's the goddess of abundance. Her eyes are covered. She's got money spilling out of that cornucopia of things. Money all over her feet. And beautiful hair. Beautiful detail. Timu does a good job on its statues. Smile for this picture. Okay, we don't know. I mean, we don't know what's going to be a thumbnail picture for this video. Maybe I'll just upload a big picture of Loki's face for a change instead of any of this stuff. Because, you know, I'm not having the best hair day. Am I ever? When was the last time I had a good hair day? I don't even know. But I am getting it cut next week. So, yay. I don't know how I'm probably just gonna get some chopped off way off no of course not and then I'm getting it colored the next week and I think I'm gonna go blonde okay put this right here for right now okay so what was that now maybe that'll help me figure out what order we're in we are in order number number oh there it is Stop it. We are in the order of... Wait, did that say price adjustment? No? Okay. Today, a weird thing happened to me when I was trying to get a price adjustment. It said, because of complications with your payment method, I use PayPal. I don't know what that means. It says, we can only refund your price adjustment to your original form of payment and not your credit not credit your Timu account, which I thought was weird. And I didn't want a dollar fifteen credited back to me in two weeks or whatever. I just um am gonna wait and check that again and see if that's going to do it again. What did I pay? I paid nine twenty five for that lady and she is now seven ninety. Okay. So there's that. I don't know, Tina is strange sometimes. The next thing in here is a uh, 
luggage scale. Oh, okay, so you do that and lift up your luggage and it'll tell you how much your luggage weighs. What well, can we not go over? Something like 88 pounds or something? Did I just randomly make that up off the top of my head? I don't know what the weight requirements are for luggage on airplanes, but I did get a luggage scale. And I think it was ultra cheap. That... I should put that in my tags, ultra cheap, uh, $2 and 37 cents. And it's now $2 and 37 cents portable electronic luggage scale. Okay. Very cool. All right. Next it's a beat up tin sign. Why do I keep buying tin signs? Just stop with the tin signs. It is, oh, it's laundry knowledge. I did want to put this in our laundry room. How to pre-treat stains. I'm doing laundry right now. What wash care symbols mean. That's good to know. Do's and don'ts. The ultimate guide to laundry. Very neat. Neat. I like those informational tin signs. Tin sign cost five dollars. Really? No. No, no, no. Stop being Mr. Magoo and put your glasses on. I changed my fingernails today, you guys. I changed them to those clear ones with little bunnies on them and little pearls and little whatever. I did that at lunch. I got a lot done at lunch. Picked up my prescriptions, did my nails, ate something, took the dog out. What what was I doing? Oh, I paid three eighty four for that laundry knowledge metal tin, and it's now five forty eight. Hmm, I don't know why I got it for three eighty four. Okay, next in here. Oh, wait a minute. What is this? This, these are, ew, they're leggings, but they feel, I'm not feeling them. They don't have any, um, they're not going to hold anything in. If anything, they're going to accentuate, accentuate, they're going to accentuate all your dimples and stuff because they're not very thick and they're not very firm. They do have cutouts down at the bottom, which is why I ordered them, but I don't see those working out at all anywhere in my life ever. And are they in this order? Solid cut out skinny leggings, $7.99. They are now $7.98. Now, Here's what they look like on a beach. And stop the glare. Stop the glare. And see, it's not the same. <laughs> These aren't that tight. And I don't know. I'll try them on, but I don't I don't have high expectations for them. Okay, the next thing in here, the next thing in here. Why did I get on this clothing kick all of a sudden with Timu? These are some jeans. Oh, Lord. I wonder why. I wonder how many pairs of jeans I have from Timu now. I really want to say eight. What's special about these? Or... 
why did oh are those big flared legs hmm are they doing something on the oh the front's kind of cute the front is button fly with two pockets they smell like i don't know and i'm trying to figure out if the legs are straight or flared or slightly flared I don't know. I will find out though, because they're right here. High waist patchwork bell bottom jeans. And I got them in an XL for, uh oh, we have a problem. I didn't wear Golden Girls earrings today. After all, I wore these bunny earrings because Easter. And I felt like there was too many faces because I got the bear face down here on this sweater. And then I didn't want to have like four faces hanging from my ears. It was just like too many faces spoils the show. But I didn't mind having like a pair of ears and a pair of ears. So that's why I picked these earrings. I put a lot of thought into it. Okay, I paid $17.84 for those jeans. I got them in an XL and they are still $7.84. Here is supposedly what they look like on. They are really high-waisted. And they could be cute. They could be not cute. So I'm looking forward to finding out. They're different. Oops. Okay, next. is oh i'm looking blotchy and tired blotchy and tired when i get tired i look blotchy this is a little cardigan i think i think or is it a little now it is a little spongy I'm not going to say it's the best material in the world. It is a gray cardigan. And what I liked about it, and I'll show you in the picture. I like the way the back flared out. That looks cute. I thought it would look cute with leggings. And then we're done with clothes. No more clothes. Now it's summer. It's starting to get hot. Elegant, cozy, open front cardigan, $14.79, light gray. See, look how cute the back looks. Wait, let me get it away from the glare. That's what the back looks like. It's really cute well, on her. And the front, of course, tube top under it and drinking coffee. The front just looks like this. We'll see. We'll see how it looks. All right. Oh, how much is it now? It is $16.48 now. Where is my... I paid $14.79 for it. Okay, let me consolidate some trash. All right. The next thing in here is a travel razor, which I mean, I really didn't need. I could get just a disposable razor anywhere, but I thought it was cute. Let's get it out. little cute razor and a little cute case that's really cute i love it open it up don't break a nail little tiny razor to take to tokyo if you're new to my channel hi i usually have a lot more energy than this and i'm a lot more entertaining um and i am going to japan in a couple of months. So when you see, if you're new to my channel, when you see travel things, that's what I'm talking about. 
that's what I'm talking about. And um, if you're returning, thank you so much for returning. And this is an ASMR version of hauling because I'm just... Okay, 177 was how much I paid for that little travel razor. And it is now $2.07. And now these are little gold flats because gold is my favorite neutral. It goes with everything. And I don't know. I need flats and sure. They're fine. I love metallics as neutrals. So nifty. I'm gonna throw these over. I did it. I have a big pile of shoes over there. I've got to put together the shoe rack that I bought on Timu like last year and put it together and put my shoes on it. Until then, they're just in a pile over there. Kind of hurts me to look at them. Okay, I paid $8.77 for those and they are now $8.47. And you can get those in all black, the gold that I got or like a beige. So neat. Okay. Next thing is a silicone folding bottle for water. So we are going hiking one day in my Japan trip itinerary. And I kind of thought it was, would be cool to carry a bottle of water around that you could squish down to nothing when you were done drinking out of it. Or I just thought this thing was cool. I mean, let me see if I can get it out without breaking a brand new nail. Oh no, it's got tight rubber bands around it. No, it's going to take, it is, it's totally going to take off my fingernail. It is, it is, I can feel it. I can predict the future. And the future says, no nails for you. Okay, so you take this bottle, wow, okay. And you fill it up with water. It's not very big. It holds what? Like 8 ounces maybe? 16 ounces? I will look. There it is. All puffed up. Okay. And then as you drink it, you smoosh it down like an accordion. And then you just shove it in your back pocket or whatever when you're done with it. Or you could take a plastic bottle and throw it away somewhere when you're done with that. I don't know. I just thought that was kind of fun. Cute little, was I doing my everything less than a dollar challenge that then I didn't, didn't work out? Let me see. Collapsible silicone water bottle, $3.32 is what I paid. And it's $5.43 now. Unless you get that color of green that I got, and it's five ninety four, five forty three for blue, five fifty one for pink, and five ninety four for gray. Well, that's weird. Okay, make it a different price with every different color. Okay, next is. I just have this one bag. It's not going to be a very, I don't think it's going to be a very long haul. It's a little box. Oh, it says liquid glow. Okay, it's a dupe of um, Benefit High Beam. And I hope I got the wrong shade. Well, shoot. 
It's a little liquid highlighter, except I got the wrong shade. Woo! That's pretty, though. Nice. Anyway, it'll look nice when I have makeup on. Like, the makeup of the day is kind of rubbed off by now. I should have done my face before I got on camera. But you know me. I like to just jump on camera, make a video, upload it, and be done with it. The guy at work cannot get over I sit next to this guy at work, and he cannot get over it. He's like... I can't believe you don't even edit. You don't do anything. And I go, I don't. I just record and upload. And he's like, how can that be? He just can't get it through his head. Okay, it is um, Party Queen's Radiant Waterproof. Blah, blah, blah. I paid $4.04 for it. Highlighter, metallic liquid highlighter. And it's now $3.98. And it comes in a whole bunch of different shades which really threw me off because the one I really wanted was like the rosy I got moonstone number three moonstone so what that says yeah but I really wanted this one over here that sold out number two rosy glow I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to subscribe to that and see if it comes back. Okay, so, neat. Okay, I got these hiking boots. Wait a minute, not you. But I don't know. Let's see. I'm going to walk the dog in them and see how they do. I got these hiking shoes. And are they going to be any good? Ooh, look at the bottom. That looks like a hand. Um, I don't know if they're going to be any good or not. Here, let's smile for a thumb. Ew. Ew, I'm fascinated with this. Okay. Would it help if I took my little ice cream cone brush and brushed it? Can I brush this down? Oh, that just made it worse. There, brush that over. And then brush all this down. Okay, don't mind me while I just primp on camera. Here are the shoes. Look at my shoes. I don't know. They're nice. We'll see. I'll, I'll give them a test run. We'll see how they do. We'll see if I can throw these in my suitcase for Mount Fuji Day. And that is... These were... I think they're kind of cool looking, though. I think they're cool. And they were... Insulated women's trekking boots, twenty two seventy seven. Fashion solid color hiking boots. Um, nine ninety nine is what they are now. Oh no, they're too. I don't know what color or size was nine ninety nine, but no, they're mostly twenty two seventy seven. I don't know what was what I don't know what was nine ninety nine. The blue ones, well, I would have gotten blue. Where are my glasses? That's what I'm doing. I'm trying to find my, are they on my head? No. Are they around my neck? Now, wait a minute. Here they are. I like the blue. If I get them in a size eight, they go up to 22.77. Okay, I was going to say, why in the world didn't I get the blue ones? 
All right. Let me fix my glasses. They're around my head. Like they're supposed to be. Using my monitor as a mirror. Let me put this up. Maybe that'll help a little bit. The next thing in here is a little... It's really small. It's a lot smaller than I thought it was going to be. It's a little purse that goes around your waist on a belt. But I mean, what can you put in here besides lipstick? It's cute. Oh, look how little and cute it is. It's little and cute. And does it have any slip pockets? <laughs> slip pockets. Zippered pocket? No. Okay, it's just, it's, of course, it's just like this inside. And then the back, you run this belt through it, and you run it, you wear it around your waist. So, okay. Right on. You could put change and cash in there. And wear it around your waist. The trash in here. Oh, we're shaking. Sorry, we're shaking. Here, we're falling down. What's going on back there? We got the alien. We got Percy. We got, we got all, everything. I gotta, um, I don't know. Get rid of all those things. Okay, four, not Percy. Four thirty nine is what I paid for that. And it is now four forty nine. And here's what it looks like on a model. Stop. All right, all right, all right, all right. <laughs> I'm done getting aliens. But these are cute earrings. But I think we've had enough aliens. We've had enough aliens to last us a lifetime. I just don't think I need any more ever. But I like those earrings a lot. And those earrings were 98 cents and they are still 98 cents. This is really cute, cool. This is a vintage style magnetic bookmark. Where's my book? Why am I always trying to find it? It's probably under those jeans. I'm not gonna. Uh. Okay, so you put this, you take this little book. Let me get it out. Nifty, I really like it a lot. If I can get it out and show everybody here. Concentrate. Okay. It still doesn't want to come out. There. It looks like this. And you put it around the pages that you're reading and it clamps shut. And it's just a nifty little bookmark like that. I don't know. You gotta be a book lover, I guess, to appreciate it. Or not, maybe everybody does appreciate it. It was $3.48 or nine, I don't, I can't see that. $3.49 or $3.48 and it's still, okay, $3.48. And for instance, so you mark your pages like that. And yeah, it looks cool. All right. Next. Is, I don't know what this is. Oh, it's an adapter uh, plug, travel universal adapter, and you got all this stuff going on in the back. 
and it's just it adapts to different countries yeah surge protector it's got i don't know what this does i don't know what this does i don't really want to start messing around with it until i read the instructions okay 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 you can do it can be like that is it supposed to be turned like that i don't know or it can i think this flips up this part this i think it flips up or it can be one of these And then it's got two of these USB things on the side. Oh, this is just to peel the plastic off. Nice. We love doing that. All right, cool. What did I pay for that? They told us to bring one. Six fifty one worldwide all in one charger. Six fifty one. Oh wait, why is it doing that? Stop it. Okay, it got, it comes with U.S. Euro, U.K., Australia. Dual USB. Oops, it does not convert voltage. USA, Australia, New Zealand, New Zealand, UK, Europe. Uh oh, it doesn't say Japan. Oh well. Anyway, cool. Oh, here's the little book. Good. It does have a little book. throw that in one of my carry-on cases right now okay next in here are some really some more bird earrings if you caught my haul from last night two pairs of bird earrings in there the bird says what and then this one has another pair of bird earrings it's actually they're kind of cute one's a cage and one's a bird so I like that a lot. It's different. It would have matched this sweater. I would have worn that today, maybe, if it weren't Easter. Okay, birds. Because spring is here and the, the shaking again. Because spring is here and the birds are out. I don't know where the cats are. Let's be really quiet. Okay, $159 is what those cost. They're now $179. You can get them in red copper, which is what I got them in, or you can get them in a silvery color. And then next are some little flowers, flower earrings. That, I don't know, I guess I just liked them at the time. You hang them from your ears. Like so. They're cute. They're cute. And they are... How much did I pay for those? Could they maybe not be in this order? There they are. Vintage hoop earrings. Retro flower 89 cents and they're still 89 cents and they only come in silver okay how many things is in this are in this order next in here are i don't even know this is a keychain or a purse charm
okay? It's just a purse charm with little gems on it. I don't know. And I'm guessing you do this somehow to take it apart and put it on here and through whatever else. I don't know. I have no idea. I'll, fi I'll figure it out later. What did I pay for that thing? Here. I paid... $4.66 Universal Car Keychain Pendant. Okay, is it broken? I don't know. Pink, white, black, purple. $4.89 is what it costs. And I must have just really liked it when I saw it. Percy... The next thing in here is this. I have no idea what this is. I don't... Oh, I think it's a little silverware set. If I'm remembering correctly. If I can get... Okay, it's got a fork. It's got a fork. You put it in the little stems. I don't know, but it's got a fork. It's got a spoon. And then it comes with, uh, it's got a knife. cheese and I think it it's got chopsticks right here it's got chopsticks and you just put them all together on their little stems and travel with your little silverware You never know when you're going to be in a pinch and you're going to need a fork or a knife or some chopsticks or a spoon. Now, how in the world do I get all these back in there and close it? Come on. Come on. Really? They're not going to lay flat? Oh, they will if I have something to say about it. Maybe not. Okay, kind of. I kind of got it closed. Okay, that's really cute. I really like that. I really like that. And they are those, what is it? Wheat? wheat? Okay, one fifty two is what I paid for those. Wheat straw. Um, collapsible travel cutlery with wheat. Straw case 152. And you can get them in a variety of colors. You don't have to get pink. You can get blue. You can get green. You can get all these purple. You can get beige. Whatever your heart desires. Very cool. All right. Next in here is a little bottle of um, Laneige. Is that how you pronounce it? And really, this is the real stuff or no? I wanted to try it. It's the Laneige water bank blue hyaluronic emulsion it's just a moisturizer 
but, and I don't know if this is the real, oh, I've got glue all over my fingers and when I tried to put these nails on, it made a mess. Um, I don't know. I wanted to try it. I couldn't believe it. I couldn't believe that was a real brand. It probably isn't. But it costs $4.99. I thought it would be bigger. And it's now sold out. Okay. Here it is down here. For $20.17. Never mind. That's not the same thing. Okay. All right. Did you guys see in my community feed? I found gummy. I didn't find it. A subscriber emailed me and said, look, there are snacks on Timu. And they were gummies. And you could order them. I ordered some just to see, like, what? Really? They're going to start selling candy? That's trippy. If they start selling candy, I don't know, you guys. Are you guys going to order it? Don't waste your money on candy when you can get candy anywhere. Okay, the thing, next thing in here are, these are tank top dresses, but I thought maybe they, ooh, they're damp. Ugh, they stink. I thought maybe I could just pull them off as long tank tops to wear over leggings and stuff, but I don't know. These really are kind of dressy. They come down a little too far to pull off as a long tank top. But you do get a black one and you get a blue one. I got them in XL and you get two of them for $13.97. And no, I'm not going to wear them as dresses because, I don't know, my knees look like elephant knees. I'm self-conscious about my knees these days. My knees are really saggy and creepy looking. I don't like people to see my legs. That's the one part of my body that I like to keep covered up, which is a shame. I don't mind like my arms or anything like that, even though they're little, you know, noodle arms. Okay, this is Hero Range. What in the world is this? Kiro Range Light Exposed Lip Gloss. Oh, okay. All right. He, Hero, Here, Orange. Her, Her Orange. I don't know. It could say Hero Range. It could say Her Orange. I'm guessing it says her orange. Why do I always buy these lip glosses? Why? Alright, it looks like this. And there's no way I'm putting this on. It's not that bad. I mean, you shouldn't use your monitor as a mirror. All right, we'll see. I feel it drying up my lips as we speak. Is it matte? Is it getting on my teeth? All right, that stuff. Now it's going to get on my teeth. I bought two different colors, $1.98 each. Okay, I got two of these. For one ninety eight each. Because you guys remember, I'm trying to get away from that berry color I always get. Or that orange nude color I always get. So here's another one. Let's see what color this is. Pink. Orangey pink.
I'm still looking for this one pair of pants and I don't think it's in this bag. I've got one more bag downstairs, so it must be in that one. And some cute tops. This is more of a, I don't know you guys, they look exactly the same to me. Oh no, they don't, they look different. Okay, this one's more of like a nudish, nude kind I always get. Okay, $1.98, how much do they cost now? They cost $1.79 now. Okay, still not on my teeth. All right, good. Okay, what are we doing? I'm 45 minutes, and this has been so boring. I'm so sorry. This is one of those little things that you put this around your water bottle here, and you can carry this while you're hiking. So I am ready for some kind of a hike. I've got the boots. I've got all the little gadgets. So for this, for instance, you would take this thing and you would put it over your water bottle cap like this. And then you would take this and hook this on your belt or whatever, hook it on your, hook it on whatever you want. And then I don't know what this does, but cool. All right, and that was 148. Okay, so this guy, and it's now 126. 126, man. Okay, let, let me see if I can find a picture of how you do it. How you do it? Okay. This guy has it hooked on his backpack strap. Or this guy has it hooked on, you know, his like camouflage stuff. I don't know what I would hook it on. My bra? I don't know. All right. I think we're almost done. She says she's got to be somebody's baby. This is gonna be some kind of damp, wet clothing. Now, is this underwear? are little more little tank tops you get a white one and they've got lace detailing on the front which is cute so you get a white one you get a black one nice and you get a gray one I like the lace. I like this to layer under layer. I like it for layering. Okay, what did I pay for that? I paid ten ninety two. No, ten sixty two, and they are now ten sixty two. Still ten sixty two. Okay, cool. Perfect. And then last, but so, oh, I lost a nail. Oh no, I lost a nail in this bag. I just felt it pop off. I think, unless I lost it somewhere else. Oh no, and they're fancy ones too. Ah, uh, I'll find it, I'll find it later. I'll find it when I get off screen. Or not. Okay. 
was anyone taking bets on whether or not I was going to lose a nail? And if so, what time? It's the 50 minute mark. And this is a gray little cardigan with ruffles. And it buttons in front, I hope. I hope this comes unbuttoned. Oh, it snaps, it snaps in front. It's a little small. Looks tiny. Let's see. It ruffle solid knitted cardigan thirteen eighty nine and um it's now fifteen forty nine and Here's what it looks like on. Stop. So, I don't know, you guys. I don't know what it's going to look like on me. I have no idea. I'll, we'll have to see. All right. Now I'm going to frantically try to find my poor fingernail that just popped off. And... You know, glue it back on. Okay, everybody. Well, thank you. And I'm sorry that was kind of just mellow. No jokes. I don't know, you guys. I'm just not myself these days. I'm not myself these days. And I'll feel better once this week is over at work, I think. Because it's a really stressful week at work. And it's hard for me to um, then come home and film a video when I've been like, like this all day long at work, maybe. But anyway, I love and appreciate you guys so much. Thank you so much for watching. And thank you for hitting a thumb. You can hit a thumbs down if you want. I would. And thank you for your kind comments down below. I might not even upload this video. I didn't like the energy in it. And maybe it'll be one of those. But if I do, anyway, I hope you have a nice evening, afternoon, or morning, whatever it is where you are. And I will see you tomorrow. And until then, and then we say, how do I stop this thing? How do I stop this thing?